Hello everyone! Welcome to my spooky pocket letter tutorial. It's not spooky at all. I just want to have fun with it. So, um, this pocket letter in particular is done for a specific friend and we have similar interests. Um, we both love Buffy and Walking Dead and Zombies. So I kind of wanted to do a Buffy and, and uh, zombie themed pocket letter. So here I'm just stamping out uh, the zombie stamp that I got, I don't remember where, but I've had it for a while, and then I'm using these alphas from Target just to spell out it's zombie time. Um, and before that I used some Heidi Swap mists to add some color to the background. Um, here is another pocket where I'm sharing some bows. So you can see like, I'm using themes like zombies and vampires, but it's bright and colorful still anyways like that's my style I love bright and colorful vibrant colors and black and white and creepy cute this zombie girl image I colored up with my Copics and it's from oddball art and it's a digital image and she's one of my favorites she's really cute so I'm just adding her into this project life card that I cut down and I added some of my favorite washies Thumbs up for Spike! If you guys are watching and you love Buffy, let me know because it's my ultimate favorite TV show of all time. And I actually had this picture printed out since 2002. I was in secondary 2. I was really young when I printed that picture. This pocket, I'm really excited about this pocket. Okay, so I made the background with some washi tapes and this is just chicken. It's a stamp boutique image that I colored up. But the fun thing is, this is another Buffy themed pocket because, um, okay, so if you guys watch Buffy, you know there's a character called Anya and she hates bunnies. That's her fear is bunnies. And she's like an ex-demon, so you would think she'd be scared of something else than bunnies. That's supposed to be her, like, when she was her demon style, I guess. I don't know. And I just punched out, well, I die cut these gold foil bunnies, which is one of my new dies. And I love these bunnies. I've been die cutting them from everything out of like every kind of paper. And now I'm spelling out Anya's bunnies with these, um, these alphas that I have. So here you can see the different items I put in that pocket and I actually added this candy which is a bunny. Um, hello, how funny is that? <laughs> I'll tell you, I was so excited about this pocket. So I added those bunny die cuts and hearts and that bunny candy. So this is a note card that I got from Michaels and I just cut it in half and I'm rounding the corners so that they match up. And this is where I write my note. Um, I actually move it back down, I didn't like it there. Um, it's not, it's not going to stay on the top. And here I used the stamp of image that I had called heads and I cut it down to size and now this is where I'm going to put my stamped images that I want to share with her. And these are some of my Mama Elephant Halloween um, die cuts, like things that I stamped out and I'm adding them behind the zombie girl. And I'm sharing some washi and I'm just putting it behind the picture of Spike. And it's funny, that picture, um, I knew right away that I wanted to use it when I was going to swap with her. I'm like, this is perfect. Um, I'm just spelling out stamped or stamped love in that heart because I stamp fatigue was just too big and I wanted it to fit in that part so that's what I'm doing here now I'm adding some titles to the pockets and I just spelled out spikes washi with some Amy 10 alphas and now these are some um, foam thickers And 
And now I'm using my Purple Wink of Stella to add some shimmer to the hay that I spelled out with those stickers. And I'm using my purple because it's dark so you won't see the color. And um, so for black letters and stuff like that, I use the black, the purple one because I just want to save up on my clear. So here I'm just adding some extra little finishing touches and I'm adding some star die cuts and stuff to the to that pocket. And um, I decided to use this card. I cut it up. It's from the Project Life Trinkets Kit and I stamped this skeleton that I have. Um, and I'm spelling out the Walk Among Us and it kind of goes well with this living dead theme because vampires are living dead and they walk among us or so they say and so are zombies. And that's why I put um, some post-it notes because she does some planning. So that's what the back and the front look like. And I'm glad that you guys um, enjoy watching my videos. And I, I hope you like this one too. I know the theme is different. I hope you guys still enjoyed watching. And if you have any questions, just let me know. I'm going to add some still pictures at the end. So thanks so much for watching and have a great one. Bye.